listening to the Python Podcast with James, Nick, Gigi, Josh, Sam, and Tom. Ring the bell. I am TPP the fuck. <laughs> this bitch. <laughs> How you been, ho? Uh, yes, I'm back been? and I'm better. Like Bryson Tiller. Nick, yeah, I know you, you don't know who that is because you probably don't have R&B stations in Canada, but yeah. <laughs> oh? Bryson Tiller, he's the one that's a son, some artist, right? <laughs> saying no one asked for that, James. Huh? No. It's, it's, oh my God, you're floating in the river right I now. I know, for real. She sounds like she's speaking out of a can. <laughs> Oh, well, I, I had to do this show from school because none of you guys can wait for me to get home, but yeah. Bitch, how far away is your house from your school? Just across the desert, James. Well, I, was, I was in an actual city. I'm like you too, so it's a little bit of a waste. <laughs> Bitch, I'm in a capital city here, so don't even try. I ain't tell none of you hoes where I live. <laughs> Rhode Island, ho, we know. The fuck? Ain't nobody gonna find me. <laughs> they gotta find you, James. Oh my god, yeah, not put the city that isn't on the map. That's oh, bitch, boobai. I can't. You guys, she's been on the show for a minute and she's already trying with the shades. She's already trying to snatch her edges. Like, <laughs> team, uh, too much. Anyway, let's talk about wrestling. So, Gigi, that's boring word to you nowadays. Yeah. Um, but yeah, so it's WrestleMania week and let's talk about Raw. So, let's talk about Wait, Divas. hold on. What? Wait, hold on. Before we get into Raw, Gigi, let's talk about your boy, Dean Ambrose. What? <laughs> he's fine, ain't he? Ooh, he's fine. <laughs> who? Are we talking about the same dirtbag? Uh, you fucked him up, so why are you saying who? Now we say who to Brad Maddox, because really, it's like, oh, who? All right, all right. Oh, I, let, let me I get her back. back in the back Excuse me, your man was on Total Divas a few days ago. Hold on. <laughs> your man's also was in gonna be close to our river here soon i yeah. still don't believe y'all because this video just disappeared when it was time for gg Clearly to look at i'm just saying because of all the DMs and i know both you and um nick smoked that marijuana <laughs> <laughs> don't play bitch because all don't these that in. all these dean ambrose fangirls just got together and got that thing off the internet i will find it i know tumblr <laughs> is the deep abyss and Everything ends up on Tumblr. So I will find that shit on Tumblr. He is going into the fucking river. Uh, you, know, you held on so hard to Sahara. We had to, like, drag her. And you were just, like, in your pickup truck. And she was just on the end. No, and you were just driving. Sahara so she wasn't getting there. So that, bitch, that bitch got into the river, though, at the end of the day. Yeah, she got a good yeah, wash. Yeah, but y'all dragged her out. She was coughing up water and steam. <laughs> and y'all just dragged her out like it was an episode of Baywatch. I'm sitting here like, no, no. Well, bitch, I'm sorry to say, but your ratchet ass man is in dire need of a good wash, so he's going to the river. In the well, river, bitch. He's going to be in a match with Brock Lesnar, so then he can wash after, like, the match. He can take a little yeah, shower. Yeah, he's going to get his, he's gonna get his ass beat. Because Seth doesn't know about that, because, you know, he's injured, because mm. <laughs> that cross workout and Brad is fired. So. Well, all I'm going to say is, don't get so comfortable, Gigi, because that video just came out, and it hasn't blown up yet. Not many people have seen it yet. We were just so lucky to catch it. So, once it comes back around, I don't know if he's going to be so lucky, especially with Darren Young running around backstage. <laughs> oh, God, you know? <laughs> uh-huh. You know what I mean? Because he's in the oh, river, Jesus. too. Oh, Jesus. Somebody tag that to Darren Young. Mm -hmm. Oh, my God. Let that ha Oh, let's not even put that out there. Actually, let's oh. do it. Listeners, when I find this fucking... Hey, hey, calm down. Calm down. No, because down. they did this. They hey, did this shit sisters, to Zara. Come back. Oh, don't have this happen. Kid, they spread Zara's business like a dirty rash. And she posted it on her own Instagram, first of all. She posted it on public forum. Dean may have... I haven't seen the video, so I don't know if he's looking into the camera. Oh, he's, he knows oh, the cameras. He, he right knows there. the camera's there. That's the but crazy part. You say how Josh... Because Josh got y'all together. He, like, just went lawyer on it. We don't know what was going on. No, 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 no. Hold, mama, hold, how hold. It was a bunch of bullshit. Let, we both know. Let me tell you something about what Josh would say. Josh didn't get nobody together, right, bitch? What Josh did was just express how he feels like we shouldn't judge people on something that we found posted on the internet from years ago when they're not the same person anymore. And he was, like, basically speaking on Zara's part. And I was like, yeah. Oh, I, was part, okay. I was like, I agree. <laughs> I agree with the whole Zara thing. And I was like, this. that's why I <laughs> forgave her. Zara thing. <laughs> but this Dean thing, he is literally on camera t telling the guy, you're a faggot. 
how is how are you gonna leave your wife? Your son's gonna look at you as, oh my god, my dad's a faggot and he ran away with another man. How could you live with yourself? Like that's what and he was Jenny telling the guy. Bitch, Robert Smokey. <laughs> bitch. And well, the, bitch, just you wait. The wait. camera's gonna be coming no, in. No, here's what got me. It's because you posted the video and all I see is like Nick saying, Gigi, explain it. And then I finally get to look at my phone and seeing it and it was gone. It just took like, forever to load up on that. Oh, bitch, it took too long. It's the phone. Excuse me. Oh, I was at work. I don't know if y'all know about that, but I was uh, I was trying to get money mm-hmm. legally. You were working the strip, bitch. <laughs> you couldn't catch the free Wi-Fi off the strip, <laughs> bitch. No, I graduated from the corner now. I'm on Las Vegas Boulevard. Excuse you, Ruth. She's a high mm-hmm. end. I'll be back one second. I need to get the kitties under control. Ah, TMI. <laughs> <laughs> the only gay man with pussy at this house ain't that cute. I can't. But yeah, Gigi, your boy is going into the river, girl. Until I see this video, I'm still just going to think y'all was on them good drugs and y'all just felt like messing with Gigi. I'm going to find this video for your ass. And I, you know what? Let me see if I could find it right you now. No, y'all, y'all probably taking it all out of context. No. And it's probably like from when, like, you had to think, like, Dean, he was going, like, he's like adopted. He never had a family and stuff a like that. He's dog like, shit. Angry. I don't give a damn. It's probably, it's probably a very angry time in his life. He's probably in his early 20s. Looking all ripe and sexy in his chest. Oh, oh, in his abs. Ew. Mm. Ew. And then that V-line. She says, ooh, that V-line. Ew. I know you don't get to see Brad's anymore because he's not on TV, but... Actually, Brad was at a signing hanging out with the Lucha Underground <laughs> girls. And he's oh, been how teasing. Exclusive. How high echelon. Oh, my God. He's teasing a Lucha mm-hmm. Underground debut for season three. El culo. <laughs> so let's hope. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I saw that background. He was like in some little messed up like hotel or something. Like one of the. Mm, what? Mm, it's cute. What are you I guess about? no WrestleMania access, but you know it's still cute. What are you talking about? Hmm. Brad, he's like, like his little signing at like some little booth in the corner. It's not WrestleMania access, but you gotta do what you gotta do. Where'd you see his this daughter's picture? really cute though? I'll give it to him. He's Team Swirl, so I support. Where did you see this picture of Brad? Hmm? What picture? The picture that you just said. You said you saw him signing something. No, the thing that you sent me. Like, he's isn't he at like a con or something? Oh or no, something? that was like a month ago. It was him, it was him, yeah, it was at a big signing. James was, Obsessive Ass, it was a month ago, exactly, 28 days ago, bitch, and it was around 1.35 do p.m., no Obsessive Ass. Do not, I can't wait to find this fucking video. <laughs> I'm just imagining you digging all deep into Tumblr right now. I really am, I even got Googled. <laughs> yeah, you're gonna start to hear from the cursor? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Keep it going, girl. Keep digging that hole. And I'm going to get out the hole, because probably the video's not even going to be that bad if it actually exists. The video is a mess. Oh, my God. I'm just saying. Don't na 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 Sorry, listeners. We're just bullshitting. Today's another Kiki video. They'll be high. <laughs> we did it last time. They won't probably even get in that much trouble. You know, all the stuff that JBL has done and then, like, what, Bill DeMont? Mm-mm. He's going to be fine. I don't know about this. Clearly, he's going to be fine. Oh, my God. I think I found that. No, I didn't. <laughs> I know you didn't because it doesn't exist. Girl, this video exists. It's crazy. There was some lace weed that you and Nick were smoking. You guys are probably in your own private chat, like, oh, let's act like the video puff, 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 pass. Let's act like this video came up. And then I get home from work trying to look at it. And I there's know. nothing. And then Nikki's all yelling at me, I tagged you in it. I tagged you in it. Then I go to my mentions, nothing. Somebody in WWE is reaching deep for us not to find this fucking video. Good looking out, WWE. Protect the golden child. They really are, and I'm going to find this shit if it's the last Support thing it. I do. Because he's actually talented, unlike other people who got caught up. <laughs> I can't. I can hear you clicking. You're not going to find it. Shut up. You know how good like my fellow fangirls are? <laughs> do you know how deep that is on someone's flash drive right now? They probably got like run over by a truck. Yeah, they got this shit buried, yo. 
I cannot find it. Ooh, what is this? Follow. <laughs> I saw a picture of You follow the little Dean Ambrose update? I see you. You found a no. Dean Ambrose blog. Go keep in. It was a hot wrestler's blog, and I saw a picture. Is she still trying to, like, save Dean no. Ambrose, like, <laughs> dirty edges? <laughs> No, you need to hear James clicking in the background on Tumblr trying to find the supposed video. <laughs> no, you're still digging. I am. Don't worry. Don't <laughs> worry, James. Those fangirls are still going to, they're going to find it. Give it a couple days. Somebody got to find it. And they're going to post it. And Gigi, you're going to be humiliated. The only way that's going to happen is like him and Renee break up. And then the Renee fangirls are like, no, we will expose him for the real him. Oh. Who knows? You know anyway. Thing? So it's not going to happen. Well, we came to a, a decision in the group chat that we have enough votes to put him in the river. So, sorry, G. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you're laughing. I don't see what's funny. <laughs> I, think it, I think it's funny that the guy who's going to be in WrestleMania fighting Brock Lesnar is in the river, but it's fine. It's well, fine. hey. It is what it is. He, it's going to be the cutest one in the river. That's really? the person in the river. Really? Not much competition, but still. He's going to look like a fucking frog in that fucking river. He'll fit right in. Yeah, he's going to look like a piece of shit rolling down the river. Well, <laughs> still down there because y'all just dug up that You body. know what, G? We are strong, independent gay men. And once you hear what he has to say, you defending his fucking uh, homophobic you ass. Man, you cannot yell out independent. You have a man. No, James is independent as fuck. Hey. <laughs> uh, oh, all right. She this got you shame, together. Okay. You better snatch this bitch, Nick. <laughs> Good God. Tags Nicked. Just your wait, girl. You know what? <laughs> um, side note. What? Um, Mitchy and I. Side note? Oh, you? Oh, okay. Oh, oh, you know what? Never mind. I was going to say, we were thinking about going to Vegas sometime, Mitchy and I, but I'm not going to go waste my time in that fucking desert. You got some, like, Reno people. Reno? Yeah, that's, like, the bootleg version of Vegas. That's Vegas' Canada. We don't fuck with it. We don't like Reno. Guess <laughs> seem like Reno people. There's one Chipotle there, probably. So Ew, Chipotle. I don't even like. I don't like Chipotle. So there's Chipotle in Canada. Oh, I thought you might be like, what is that? People we still have Del Taco. We haven't got a Taco Bell yet. People still. Bet people you still tried eat Chipotle. It. Wasn't there something on the news with them being closed down or something like that? Probably it's fucking gross. <laughs> That's how you know James isn't up on Connor events. That was like two months ago. No, Girl, like two months ago is not long ago. I am not eating at anywhere that's been closed down two months ago because they were put some bullshit in the meat. I'm sorry, girl. I'm not doing it. But, if that's Gigi's just, just a piece of the other thing. Your mouth is fine. Okay. I don't know, girl. You can go in there with your broken nails and get your chipotle. <laughs> I'm not doing it. All the other things you put in your mouth, but oh, no, it's chipotle, no. <laughs> <laughs> All the other things he swallowed, but not some chipotle, no, Jesus. <laughs> With some sriracha, bitch. Don't play. Oh, Gigi. <laughs> Gigi, welcome back. It's been great. I didn't oh, have my. any of Okay. Oh. Okay, so have we, like, talked enough about Dean Ambrose? We please? have. We've over-talked. Like, his dick cheese odor is, like, wafting oh. in my way, and I just, I can't anymore. What? Oh. What that smells like, Nick, but okay. Excuse you. You heard me. I didn't. <laughs> anyway, I'm not going to repeat anything. So, let's move on to <laughs> Raw, okay? Okay. We're good. <laughs> Raw? I know y'all both know about that, too. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> I hate her. <laughs> Did you know oh, I wasn't ready. I wasn't ready for all this fucking shit. She knows all about it. You know what? This bitch is in a library, too, serving the shade. <laughs> <laughs> it's a UNOV library. Calm down. She's in the library reading, all right? <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. So let's talk about Divas then first. Let's do it. Okay, so let's talk about Emma. Actually, no, the first match that we've seen on Raw was Becky versus Charlotte. With Sasha outside, she wasn't on commentary. Um, she was just sitting, so I thought that was kind of a missed opportunity. But anyway, the match between Becky and Charlotte, great. Um, Charlotte picked up the win. I think, yeah, Ric Flair kind of fucked her up on Becky and, like, grabbed her ankle, cost her the opportunity. And I thought there was going to be a beatdown at the end, and then nothing really happened. So they're kind of just, like, slowly building this up to Mania. So, um, Gigi, obviously, since you didn't watch it, I'm going to ask James first. So what do you think of it? I like that they build the match and let people know, like, they posted out the tweet that them two are going to be facing off tonight. So I Mm -hmm. thought that was cool. 
Um, I liked the match. I really did. I thought Becky had a lot of fire in her, and the crowd was really behind her. Um, what else was there? Oh, Sasha on commentary. Well, she wasn't really on commentary. I didn't really mind that she wasn't on commentary. I just wish like she got involved, kind of like how Becky Lynch got involved in her match on SmackDown. That's what I was kind of expecting. But. Yeah, but I guess she did get involved a little bit, like that little segment they had outside the ring. But anyways, Ric Flair is everything. I love <laughs> how he tripped up Becky and they like, tried to grab her and drag her out of the fucking ring. And, <laughs> and she kicked him down. Yeah, she kicked him off. And then Charlotte hit him with, hit her with the natural selection. And I'm, I'm glad that Charlotte went over and Becky lost again because it just shows that they just keep shitting on Becky Lynch. Like, Becky can't hold a candle to the flares working together and they're cheating ways. So I, I just love it. It just builds up. This match wasn't for Sasha and a lot of people are upset. Oh, Sasha, Sasha. Sasha had her moment on SmackDown. It was Becky's turn. So I'm That's glad true. that Becky got her moment to get fired up and just give more of a reason why she wants to fight harder on Sunday. So I get what they were going with it. And I didn't mind. No, it was a great match. Um, Gigi, I kind of want to just get like your thoughts because... WrestleMania, we have the Triple Threat Divas match for the Divas Championship, so I wanted to kind of get your thoughts on it. What do you think is going to go down? Are you excited for that? And, like, everything that you've heard, have you watched anything with those girls or, like, caught up on anything with that? If it's not on Instagram, I don't know about it, so um, it's good to know that Becky hasn't fallen off because I really thought it was going to be, like, Sasha versus Charlotte, but it's good to know that she's still um, relevant. Um, Sasha, I knew she was probably going to be in WrestleMania somehow, and, of course, Charlotte. I like Charlotte's new shirt. I like she keeps putting the diamonds on her face to make her look more feminine because I know it's hard for her sometimes. Oh, bitch. But, um, oh, bitch. Hold up. Hold up. That's some ratchet shit. We're, we're right not going to do that, okay? We're, we're not going to do that. Let's leave. I just don't like the diamonds on her face. What? Mm hmm. And they stay on during the match. That is a skill. That is. As much as she sweats. Stare clear, man. Oh. Stare clear. Um, that picture of Charlotte that Josh posted made me laugh with her, like, edgeless. I thought that shit was hilarious. Um, and I'm happy that they're going to be on the main card and not the pre-show, because the other match that we're going to talk about later looks like a pre-show match. It is a pre-show match. No, but, like, it looks like a, it looks like it needs, like, pre-pre-show, but yeah. Oh. <laughs> Which match is this, Deans? <laughs> you're so funny when he's facing Brock Lesnar, the UFC champion. I love so, how I love how so you silly. I love how you have to sell the match with Brock Lesnar. You can even right. sell it with Dean himself. Oh, like um, Steph didn't fight Brock Lesnar. I know, or, but and Brad we, didn't fight anybody people, except for Randy. Uh, hey, you guys hey, asked sweetheart. Him, okay. Hey, hey, hay. Seth was champion. Okay. Mm-hmm. That's how I. <laughs> all right, and, all right. And, and that was such a memorable, memorable run. Tell me all the good things that happened during Nick. And don't fall asleep while doing it like I did. As I'm just saying, who's champ? Oh, stop watching. Can you let me finish, please? Good. Good. No, I'm, back. Uh, I'm back. I talk when I want. I'm just going to say, your greasy ass boy hasn't held that championship. So that's the only thing I'm going to come up with. Mm-hmm. And Seth held it, and he got hurt. And I can't say one memorable thing except like he got the um, authority of Cadillac. Well, GG. He what? probably couldn't afford himself, but okay. That's not his fault. That's his creative fault, but. Gigi, what I can tell you is that when Seth Rollins comes back, all your faves will be snatched bald. Snatched, so just wait for it. But then again, she's not watching it anyway, so who really cares? Oh oh, Oh my god, Nick, your recording sounds like shit. You're coming through, like, so bad. Who, mine? Yeah, it's, like, staticky. I'm gonna gonna hang up and recall. Okay, it's Gigi's fault, by the way. I think it is. (laughs) A mess, you guys. A mess, these two. Mm. Let's see. Bitch. I'm putting his Rogers Wi-Fi on me. Thank you. Look, this bitch lost complete service. What does it say Nick Angel was unable to join? A mess. Let me get him back in here. You guys were getting too vile. <laughs> Skype couldn't hear them. <laughs> Skype could not. What's going on? Let's see. I'm going to try to call CMGG. See if he'll answer. You think he's going to answer? <laughs> if he's awake, yeah, he probably is awake. What time is it in Britain, technically? I don't know. 
They like we gotta wait anyways. I cannot carry on a show. Without Hello? Hello there, Samuel. Hi. What are you Good doing? Morning, what? I brought a friend. Good morning over there. What time is it over there? Uh, just after midnight. Is it? What are you doing? Are you with a guy? Just No, I'm just finishing work. Oh. Ooh, work, work, work. Yeah, I'll, work. I'll, get, I'll, I'll call back when I'm... Wait, just tell the listeners hi. You're on the show. Oh, he don't like you guys. Oh, he left? Oh. <laughs> he's in manager mode. <laughs> <laughs> Why is he picking up the phone while he's he at said, work? Did you see how, like, upstanding he sounded? Like, hello. Yeah. <laughs> Fake ass. <laughs> Fake ass, bitch. <laughs> Let's see who else we can get, Gigi. <laughs> I'm uh, Megan's on. <laughs> Let's see if Megan. <laughs> oh god, I'm having fun. Sorry, guys. This is just a shit show, and it's WrestleMania week. I can't. <laughs> no, this is how it's when they actually put together a WrestleMania. It's like a shit show. Everyone's everywhere, and I was picking up the phone. And plus, the listeners miss GGG, so you might as well just bullshit with her. Oh, Megan ignored her phone call. <gasps> no, she didn't. How dare she? Is there a baseball game on? That's probably why. Maybe we should tweet out at the Pipe On Podcast. Oh, she's at work. Everybody's working. She, damn, everyone's at work. <laughs> Hold on. I'm going to tweet. I'm going to send out a tweet on our twitter account and let's see if anybody bites so listeners if you're listening to this now you're gonna be real mad that you didn't give us your skype because you were foolish enough to be away from your twitter at this point let's see Man, some I of these supposed to stay on twitter these young children what happened i know a lot of them stay on <clears throat> i'm gonna say hey listeners drop your skype name now, and we'll call you. Oh, no, I'm doing a pre-screening before um, we add anybody. <laughs> Why not? It's more fun. <laughs> We're not having another... What was that boy's name? Brian. Brian? Brandon. Who are you talking about? Oh, Blake. That was Blake. We don't need another Blake. Oh, don't do it, bitch. We don't. Be nice. Blake is a loyal mm-hmm. listener. A lot of things are loyal, like puppies. Puppies are cute. Hmm. Not all puppies. There's actually a listener I want to give a shout out to as well. Um, um I don't, I don't watch. I don't even look in the comments. Uh, um, Isaac, shout out to you for having the same photo for about like two years now. <laughs> right, he's so easy to find though, so that's good. Um, there's like two black guys down there. Good job to y'all for, you know. Shout out to Erica Carney. I love her. She's, she's a loyal supporter. Erica, hey girl. Her name is, um, her Twitter name is hi Erica 117. So go follow her. She's a, she's a long time listener. Last time me and Nick were giving out shout outs. I forgot to mention her. She don't follow me, so she must not be that great. So, um, who else can we shout out? She doesn't like you. Hmm? Oh, that's too bad for her, then. <laughs> Let me find a fuck to give. Oh, I left them all at home. She's so mean, guys. Ugh. How do they like you? Because. <laughs> they, they like you. I'm not mean. I'm a very sweet and caring person. I just lack a soul or any humanity. That scares me. Like, our listeners mm-hmm. love to be abused. Oh, like don't have James well. calling you cute. You're going to end up in the back of a trailer somewhere. Bitch. Careful. <laughs> God. F- <laughs> You're like twisty. Uh, I said, uh, I think that, is that how you pick up your guys, James? I just imagine you being like twisty, how he got um Matt Bomber's character. No, bitch. No? I'm incorrect? Okay. Yes, yeah, so that's how you do things I in usually, Rhode Island. I usually don't approach guys. Hmm? Oh, you're, oh, you're like, like, oh, that should be like Batman, like you come down from the ceiling. No. Hello. Samuel. Oh, you, you see Hi. now how he rides you when he come on? I'm like. How are you, what? dog? Are, are we sure how was your show? You are alive on air. Oh, I can see Gigi. You are live. Wait. She's grilling. Uh, uh, uh. 
I should take a screenshot of this. This is hilarious. <laughs> Dance. Work, 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 work. Are you in the bathroom? I can't. <laughs> Okay, get it, get it, get it, get it. Oh, no, he did it. Save this PG show. What's wrong? <laughs> I'm <Hi>. done. <laughs> Gigi's like, bitch. <laughs> All the, all the white asses that I wanted to see. Aww. This one, that was the top ass. I can't. You Do can, I have to stay on video now, or can I just have on voice? You can, you can get, <laughs> get on the regular Slix phone. Just right, get on the regular. Yeah, this one gets to see me. It's okay. I want to see me, too. What the hell? No want to see me. No, James is just not playing. He's just not. How has the show been tonight? What's going on? Listen, nothing's been going on. We haven't got anything done. We've argued, <laughs> and we've been recording the whole time, and Nick's thing shit the bed, and he has all the topics. <laughs> I can't carry a show to save my life. So He what? I said, Nick's... Now, hold on. What the fuck, man? This is aggravating me. Here's <laughs> what had happened was... Yeah. Little Nick was speaking negatively of my Dean Poo, so naturally Skype was not liking that, so they Where cut him off. Actually, <laughs> Megan's just like, no. Megan just texted me too. Did she? Yeah, she's like, did you call me? And I was like, yeah, I was calling everybody because I was just like, whatever, we're just gonna bullshit on this show. <laughs> so this is like recording now. Yeah, it's recording. Yes. We're gonna give them something extra. Okay. This is just going to be a fun show, I think. I'm just going to put it up. It's, it's just going to let them know what we go through with Skype. It's a, it's basically... Like all the Skype drums. It's a true kiki, I guess. We barely talked about any wrestling. The only topic we got to is Dean Ambrose's hot mess. And I think we're going to leave <laughs> it at that. It. And tomorrow, we should just get together and redo a good show. Because I'm over at this point. I'm ready to, roll. I'm ready to roll it up. We still, we still have a chance. We were talking about how... Um, Charlotte is now looking more feminine since I've been watching. That's terrible. She's a second. Is she though? She's a second nature flair or something like that. She's beautiful. She's a beautiful woman. She is. Then, she is. Um. She is okay. <laughs> <laughs> I love James. You know, if James has kids. They're gonna think they're just like the shit, even though they might not be. Like you're beautiful and daddy loves you. Don't be such a <laughs> You are just a beautiful princess. Then you're gonna go to school. My dad calls me a princess every day. I'm a fucking princess. You're damn right. My mom called me I'm pretty. I don't want them to turn out into a she stone has, like you. She has two teeth, no eyelashes, ratty hair. My dad calls me a princess. Girl, my my daughters are gonna be hand picked, bitch. Mm. Handpicked. You heard it right. <laughs> you heard it here first. This is the exclusive. Don't play. This is like Terry's kids were handpicked, and we see how they ended up. Who's kids? <laughs> Who's? Right, Carrie. Have you seen her twins? No. Oh, don't don't look at the picture. It's James. I don't remember. <laughs> I, I, I never did. did. I've never seen ugly kindergartners in my life. But then I went on Instagram. I. Hey, but like, if since we're talking about like ugly children. Mm. Do you not? <laughs> this is not really bad now. Do you think Blue Ivy should, you know, not should be look like this, like caramel skinned angel, and not like she's part of the Orange is the New Black cast? <laughs> what? <laughs> Blue <laughs> Ivy, you know, Beyonce and Jay Z. Jay Z's. No, daughter. she still has potential. She has still has potential to be a pretty girl. You don't the, think she's she cute? Looks like she should be like, you know, you know, the she's face of like Beyonce. Baby Gap or something, not the face of Litchfield Prison for Women. I don't think she's ugly. She's I'm not saying she's ugly. I'm just saying you'd expect her to look a lot prettier. I think she is pretty. She, no, because like the Mariah Carey twins, they haven't hit their they hit their potential. <laughs> that being, for being cute kids, Blue Ivy still has time. Then who's the cutest kid ever? Mm-hmm. West, my nephew. It's the Beckham kids. Mm. Yeah, the Beckham kids. Um, they're like older now. I'm talking about like right now. <laughs> And we still oh. write. <laughs> Northwest. 
Oh yeah, she's she's a cutie. I think they're all cute. Who cares? Why are we no, talking about adorbs. babies? <laughs> what? Why are we talking about other people's children? Because <laughs> we have no we have no self compass. I have no soul. That's why I brought it up. That's true. I have no soul. Oh, it's so warm in my bedroom. Oh my god. Because all the oh, bodies you have. <laughs> all damn dicks. Are you gonna have a grinder buddy tonight? No. That's you know, for tomorrow daytime. You know what's so embarrassing? <laughs> While we were recording, my grinder went off. I was like, ooh, I hope they'll be here. The noise? noise? Yeah. <laughs> it it, went, was, one of the, it was one of the spam ones, huh, James? But surely it has to be open. It or was open, be open because I had it oh, okay. open. It went, Krup! I was like, ooh. <laughs> Are we going to talk about yours? Oh, what? oh, yeah, Ho James is back. Yes. I miss well, Ho not, not That's the, my favorite James. Not the grinder hoe. My picture is not even up on grinder, girl. I can't. Sure, not the grinder. Oh, you're a faceless. I am a faceless. Girl. I have a beautiful portrait of a tree, and the moon is in the background. It's so cute. It's totally and a wolf. Me. So gay. <laughs> it's He's actually not gay. It's a tree and a wolf, and like a witch in the background. <clears throat> it's very hipster, like. Do you use um Tinder? Nice. No, I, I t- Tinder is just full of Twinkie white boys, and that's just not my type. My Tinder is just hilarious. Why you swipe to the left on everyone? I mean, no, my profile right. says um, about so I, I once drank eight bottles of wine in one night and survived. Um, I'm the host of the international Snapchat star show. Will it float in the bar? And if you look like a woman, just say no because it's pointless. <laughs> And not in that shit. And this is what it says in your Tinder bio. I'm gonna find it. I'm gonna read out. I know. And it's sh- right next to all two of his matches. I should read out my. Bro, I got loads. Loads of what? Where'd you get your loads? Yeah, what kind of look? <laughs> I, you got loads on your back. back. Oh my! Back. Yes, I've got like the maximum. Oh lord! Distance. Yeah. So it says. Um, I once drank eight bottles of wine on a night out and let's tell a tale. Host of the international Snapchat series, let's float in the bath. Ultimately, I'm just sick of taking my mates as plus ones for family events. Uh, it's nothing personal, but if you like a woman, then don't waste a like on me. Oh, my God. Mm-hmm. Mine says... Nope. Hold on. Oh, Gigi. Gigi? This show has fallen off the rails. No, I remember I'm when you were on the saying... Road to start with, even at the train station. Gigi, remember when you said that you wanted to do, like, that lip service show? Well, here you go, bitch. <laughs> 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 Mine says... Hold on. It says... Well, this is my grinder. <laughs> it says oh, here, G- here G- out G- of Jesus. boredom. And then it says my age, which Gigi tried me for my age today. I'm Twitter. <laughs> That's 43, right? Don't do me. <laughs> it says my age, and then it says concerts, gaming, level-headed guys into low-key, chill nights, chill vibes, and then 420, of course, which means... And James and these fucking vibes. Vibes. It's Jimmy Hot vibes. Vibes. All weekend on my Snapchat, my friends started call. All my friends mm. call me Jimmy Vibes because of my Snapchat was just vibing, so... Vibes. Jimmy it's vibes. always a blunt and some trees. Say, sounds like Wendy Williams. Fuck you. I really can't. <laughs> hey, I was thinking, should I change my Instagram name to Jimmy Vibes? I'm kind of over the Jimmy James. Yeah, because Jimmy James always sounded like you have like a cousin and you fuck your cousin. Really? Oh. I don't think so. Yeah. She tried it. She's honest. So. <laughs> I'm. I don't know. I just it kind of flowed well. One of the listeners <laughs> tried me. I don't even think this was a listener. Somebody's like, you spell your names with a Y, and I was like, Con- obviously I couldn't get James. Oh no, like, if that's that's okay because the fine ass James of Chip and Jill spends, spends his name with a Y, so it's fine. Oh, so so because he spells his name with a Y, that means it's all right. A bitch mm-hmm, like me, he's fine as hell. A bitch like me, can't if, spell it, my if, name he would, with if he didn't exist, it would, it would be an issue. But he exists, so it's fine. Gigi, you should have been born a gay man, girl. I tell you, you and your mm-hmm. Chip and Dale. I think and she I- was. Oh, I think you were born you again, think, then. aren't you, aren't you? Sorry, no Bruce Caitlyn Jenner over here, buddy. <laughs> <clears throat> well, let me clarify something to the listeners. 
I am not on Grindr looking for hookups by any means. Why the fuck you lying? <laughs> I'm not. I'm like so prudish, it's not even funny. But, um. Why the? <laughs> shut the fuck up, Gigi. Ah, you too. But what I will say is this is. I was a little thought, 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 <laughs> uh, last week, and oh my god, my I took down like almost four numbers, four or five, and I've you talked, slut. I've talked to every single one of them too, and I don't give a shit. I'm single. Oh, he did you like rank them? Like some of them got like your good filtered nudes, and other ones just got the regular nudes. Um, who sends nudes? That's what Snapchat's for. Ah! <laughs> <gasps> no. Did you hear that apparently on Snapchat, if you screenshot someone, it's illegal? That's so not true. Because I got told this. I don't know if it's my friends just trying to make me stop screenshotting. Are you that gullible, Samuel? No. If it was I illegal... Like, I, I screenshot FaceTimes. We Can wouldn't have that option. I don't think Snapchat huh? would let give us that option. Would they? No, they, they can't control screenshots. You can take a screenshot of anything on your iPhone. I was screenshotting my friend on FaceTime before. I've just sent it in this little chat. What friend is this? My best friend, Tina. What did you screenshot? Is that her tits? <laughs> oh, my it fell out she was talking to me. Oh, what is she doing? She was putting her makeup on in a towel and the boob fell <laughs> <laughs> so you took a snap. Look at you die laughing in the picture. Yeah, I was like, don't Sam. laugh because you'll know. <laughs> oh my god, Sam. I'm so mad. I was thinking of you the other day. I hope sunshine. So, on Easter, I got my heart broken. Oh no. Why? Because you know how I'm planning to go to the UK hang out with you? Yeah. One of my fucking friends backed out, but I'm still going. But Which I have friend? another... Not Diego. <laughs> okay. <laughs> That's the one I'm Was it Juan? Say. Yeah, Juan's bitch ass. I'm so aggravated with this bitch. Because he's been telling me that he's going to come. He's going to come to the trip. This, that, and the third, right? So yesterday we're at Easter. He's All of a sudden he's talking about some cruise. Some family cruise. You guys should come. And I was like, when is it? He's like, oh, it's in January. I said, bitch, what do you mean it's in January? January is when we're supposed to go to the UK, and we're supposed to be going to get our passports next fucking week. So where is this? He's like, oh, but I can't go to that. He's like, I can't do the UK. I have I have EDC. I have this festival, because, you know, all the music festivals are starting up in the summertime. He has all yeah. these fucking festivals. And I'm like, yo, go fuck yourself with these festivals, because I told you that we should go to the UK, and everybody was down to go this down the third now everybody seems like they're backing off so it looks like it's just gonna be me bitch because i as diego was Ooh, saying don't get natalie holloway james huh don't end up like natalie holloway <laughs> listen bitch don't so, try okay. sam will be there i can see you i can see where I, last time seeing james is on some camera he's getting up off his knees walking into a dark room and we never <laughs> see him again <laughs> i hate you <laughs> Sam will be there. What's Nally Holloway? She's an American girl. Oh, it was this white missing. girl here in America, and she decided to go on vacation and walk off with some big white dude, and we never saw her again. And they made like a movie about it and a whole bunch of TV specials. What's the movie? Holloway. Yeah, just Google her. I'm sure the name will come up. Holloway. I'm gonna do it. Actually, it's a Lifetime movie. They say it just like that. Holloway. You guys like Tom Hardy? Oh, oh my god. You have that time we doing the Lifetime movies? That was hilarious. Samuel, do you like Tom Hardy? Yes. Do you like Tom Hardy? Yes. Gigi, do you? Yeah. I think she does. Oh yeah, he's fine. So he Only has, in like certain things that are like... He has this new movie There's this out. one pick. He has this it's new movie. movie. Legend. No. Yes! That's the movie I'm dying to fucking watch. It it's just, I watched it in the cinema. It's really good. It just and he plays twins and one is gay. It just came out yeah. on Redbox, so I'm gonna go get that. This picture that I've sent now is the one that I really, really that is like. That isn't the saddest sentence. What'd you choose? Look at that pic. That isn't the saddest sentence. It just came out on Redbox. No, it, ooh, you should, he's all Look over. Look at that. He's all over my Tumblr, Sam. Yeah. All over, but Gigi. It's an awesome movie. What, you should check it out. Look at that picture, though. I have a better picture of him. I'm winning. 
I'm winning. You should see my Tumblr. Oh, okay. God. Oh, no, I know. That's Tom Hardy's soul. <laughs> Why, what's his new movie? That's the movie I was talking about. Like, I saw it. Oh, Legend. Legend. Oh. Yes. I want to watch it. I definitely want to watch it. But anyways, I think I'm going to be going to the UK by my damn self at this point. But Sam No, you won't. You'll be with me. Exactly. That's what I'm telling you. I don't want, I don't want you to let me down. So then I'll really end up like Natalie Holloway. Because <laughs> 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 right, Sam, I want to watch James. Though. He seemed like the kind of roommate that's going like, to eat your food and put it back. But you see my money <laughs> next to the food so you can buy more. Sam wouldn't even know I'm <laughs> there. <laughs> I would. But then I'm Sam, I only have wine in his smell fridge. of weed. Oh, we have a listener who wants to come on this show. Should Did we you? Much. Jared. <laughs> who? What? Um. Oh, official J. I said James would just smell like weed. Yes, that's true. You how guys... official is this J? I don't know. Let's find <laughs> out. We're gonna call. Uh, scale of one to ten. How official are you? Hold on, I'm gonna get him in there. Do they spell official correctly? Because I came a whole came across like a whole bunch of Twitter accounts. So I don't spell official correctly. Official J, he always gives us, he sends us the good tea when something's going on in WWE, so. Oh, is that, no, is that the tea where it's like, oh, I heard from some, my friend is friends with someone at WWE, I don't know. No. Was it him? It better not be him, because if it is him, he's going to get a good dragging. Why Um, I'm confused. On our show. No, that's (laughs) Keyshawn. No, they, we have a listener, and they thought they, were, they was giving us that good tea, but it was like, ah, then you hear, because blah, 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 said that blah, blah, blah. I can tell like, you. Blah, 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 this blah, is, blah, This is what classic said. He sent us a DM. No, sh- classic, you know, it's TPP. You will get, sh- you will catch a good shading once in a while. Here we go. He goes, I got some tea for y'all. My friend works for the WWE, and word is they want to push Eva to the moon so they can debut the woman's money in the bank match so she can win the title the heel way. Nia Jax would most likely wrestle while Eva Marie holds the briefcase. How cool. Hey, he's on a good point because Eva Marie did re-debut on Monday night, so. Yeah, Mm -hmm. she did. Yeah, but Eva Marie is not climbing a ladder. I know. That's what I'm like. Uh, if this is what he's saying, Nick called bullshit. So did Gigi. I don't know. I'm calling bullshit. I didn't even respond to it when they posted. I was like, okay. You're like, okay, same. <laughs> <laughs> Hashtag cute. <laughs> like when you're not listening to a customer in work and you're like, <laughs> same. <laughs> I had a pregnant lady in work telling me about all these like pains she was going through, like, oh, and all these cravings. Oh, you just and I was like, your head? Mm-hmm. I was just oh, nodding, like, mm hmm, same, yeah. <laughs> well, you know my pain. You know my pain, Sam. Okay. Yeah, like, sucks. We're gonna call the listener. <clears throat> call the listener. Calling all listeners. I already, I already don't like them, but okay. What the fuck? Where Which listener is this that we're ringing? Offic- Official J. Hold on. Let's see. I usually don't chew gum on our shows, but this is one of those shows I'm just saying, fuck it. Uh, sorry, Official J. You got all this nonsense privacy privacy settings. That bitch, I can't get you in. It says, it says Jared can't be added to this conversation due to his or hers privacy settings. Bitch, who you hiding from? Who is you (laughs) hiding from? Oh, they doesn't. They one of those people with the private Instagram account, but they still follow you. <laughs> My Instagram is private. Oh no, we've seen your pictures. It needs to be private. Ah! Slapper, Sam. <laughs> Why? What? What? Nothing. You you were supposed to be like, mm-hmm, yeah okay. <laughs> I was reading something about cousins on Facebook and got confused. Oh, Nick thinks that he got his shit working. <laughs> no, he didn't. Screw you, Nick. You full of lies. You have ratchet nails. Oh. <laughs> is Hanaya online? Oh, I think Hanaya's online. Baby Shkar. <laughs> hey, Hanaya. Hey, girl. No, oh, no, she's not on. Um, I don't know where Nick is. Damn. Nick, girl, bye. I think Nick might be back. It doesn't say it. It says he's offline. That ratchet Canada <laughs> connection bullshit. Hello? 
Hello, it's me. <laughs> uh, hi, I got a call from um, Twitter. Who? Is this Jared? Yeah, Jared. You're from the UK? You sound British. Yeah, I am British. <laughs> Shut yeah, up! Yeah, okay, I, I like yes, him now, I like him now. <laughs> <laughs> thank you, thank you. How, how the hell is he in here? Because Skype is not telling me he's, he's in here. How creepy. Yeah. I don't. I saw the notification on my phone, and I was like, "Oh, okay." And I clicked it, and <laughs> I see all of you talking, and I'm wondering, wait, have I even been added? Have you been wait, added? Official, yeah, official Jerry. Yeah, official Jerry. I just gave you a good drag, and I was like, "Listen, your shit's on privacy, and you can't come in." So blah 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 blah. <laughs> and now I see. He's a very nice person. He's the most negative of all of us. No, Thank that you. is. No, official J, be honest. Who's the most shadiest, meanest one? Be honest. Mm. <laughs> um, I don't like that you went. <laughs> I don't like that. Because yeah, it's Gigi. I'll say it. <laughs> no, I think all of you are like, all of you have your individual thing that makes you funny. I don't necessarily find it offensive or I don't find it rude in a way. Like, I always listen and I'm just I laughing. I'm offended. laughing at all of you. I love to be when you're offended. <laughs> I love to be offensive. And how dare you say I'm very neutral? Huh? Oh, fucking get this motherfucker off my line! <laughs> oh wait, what's this? <laughs> She's a bitch, I tell you. <laughs> ah, I'm starting to see that now. <laughs> Are you from London? Yeah, I'm from London. Oh, uh, I'm gonna be there for a while. Oh, okay. I, I like his accent, so like... Sam. Yeah, because I'm northern. <laughs> And it's so that, uh, I missed out. Um, so Jared, how would you feel about replacing one of the two Brits? Because they have the same <gasps> accent, oh. and we need to switch it up. Yours, you sound like more, more like British. You sound like Gigi. You sound like Henry, words wisely. You sound yeah. like Henry Cavill British. He, he sounds like that <laughs> TV what's, what's, British. Who's what's who's Doctor Who? He sounds like Doctor Who British. Who watches oh, Doctor no, Who? I don't know. You sound like that. <laughs> who? He does not sound like Doctor Who. You lying. Doctor. Who. What's his name? Benjamin? No, it's not Benjamin. Benedict Cumberbatch. Benedict Cumberbatch. There you go. Like, Sam kind of sounds like Andrew Lincoln. <laughs> I'll take that. Is I'm like from the South. Andrew like Lincoln from the, from the Walking London, Dead. So like... he's, from, he's from the UK. Oh, he's from the South Side. Okay. Yeah, South of London, yeah. So, this is like the accent that runs around here, whereas like Sam, for instance, he's from the north. And I generally, actually, I love the northern accent. I mean, I'll even be going up north. Uh, I don't know Thursday. That personally. Where? What for? Um, I've got a uni interview uh, in Birmingham. Oh, yeah. oh, I'm not that far north. I'm like Liverpool. Oh, okay, Liverpool. Mm-hmm. Even further. I have Leeds though in next week, so I'll be oh, going a up. bit further up. Oh. <laughs> Well, oh, I'll, yeah, I don't mind. I, I'm, I'm the party type, so, yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, Jay, let us know. Who is your favorite superstar in Diva? Oh, well, uh, Diva, Naomi, of course. Of course. I, I love Naomi. Naomi is, like, my top girl. She's been my top girl since I saw her on NXT. Just the way she moves in the ring, her athleticism, the attitude, everything just boils together, and it... It just excites me. The moment that I saw her, I was like, right, that's my favorite diva. I mean, like, when you're, especially, like, when you're a black person and you see, like, Mm -hmm. a black diva come in and, like, they're rare. We've only had, like, before Naomi, there's probably about four of us, yeah. Mm -hmm. You've had Jacqueline, Jazz, Alicia. Don't you dare say Cameron. No, I say it. Cameron. (laughs) (laughs) Oh, give her some love. She's doing okay now. She's doing okay. She'll... She's doing okay. I don't accept okay. I don't accept this mediocrity that she, the rest of you accept. <laughs> you're doing okay. That's like you're, That's like if your kid came home with a D. You're doing okay. Shut your ass. Well, at least she's not on Sunny and Ashley. Oh, oh it, and... Can, it, can, it can happen. <gasps> you had to like the fall off won't happen. No, it doesn't, that that she... it doesn't get that deep. It doesn't get that deep. Come on now. Oh, All right. yeah, I, know okay. she, I know she doesn't get that deep. It's a very shallow woman right there. All right, yeah. Gigi. Let's not drag poor little Karen. We're talking about Naomi. So, Jared. <laughs> yeah, good black you, woman. There we go. How did you feel when I gave Naomi that dragon before? It wasn't much of a dragon. It was more of, I was hard on her for a while with her mic skills. 
did you see where I was yeah. coming from? Being being a fan of hers and you know really being a stand. Was I hard on? Because now I think like she's doing great. I think she's done a three sixty and she's really like owning her character. So do you get my point? Um, in some ways, I think where you were coming from, I understood in some ways, but how I saw it was that. When she, especially when she was a baby face, she was given the material she was being given, the storylines that she was being put in, didn't really give her the opportunity to really mm-hmm. show off what she could do on the mic. And everything that she was given was very generic and boring. And we couldn't really get to know her properly. But when she became a heel and she was given that background story to really showcase that, right, she's angry, she's not happy with where she is, she was really able to shine. So I think that's probably the part that I feel you missed is that we had to look at the overall storyline that she was being given at the time and realize that she wasn't really given the material well, to really show off. The thing with Naomi is I, when she was a baby face, I thought I, I enjoyed her as a baby face because she was flashy and she was fun and I didn't feel like mm-hmm. she needed much of a speaking role because she's just happy to be there baby face with cool moves. So and the fans mm-hmm. liked her and she had a big smile. So and she was the so vibrant guy. and then she had the bright colors. <laughs> she had all the bright colors. So Another she had, reason. She had all the factors of being a good baby face. So I didn't mind her. But when she switched over to a heel, <coughs> ooh, excuse me, I wasn't connecting with her because I felt like she wasn't comfortable on the mic, which was new for okay. her. But now that she's she developed this character, I gave her some time because she didn't develop this character in NXT like Sasha Banks and Charlotte and Becky did with their characters. So I give sure her that. Too. But she, out of all the divas in the past year, she's the most improved. Like, she's well-rounded. So I love oh, Naomi. Definitely. And definitely. I, I like, like you said, when we have a black diva, you know, there's only a few. I really root for them. So that's I feel like mm-hmm. that's why I was so hard on Naomi. But now she's slaying and snatching everybody up. So I'm here for it. Oh yeah, I've got I, I've got that much. I've I've made my pre order, and I can't wait to support and just really get it going. Feel the glow. Make sure that her yes, feel the glow indeed. <laughs> I like that. And I like that. Where she um, ends up. What was that, Gigi? Yeah, uh, Nick. Should I add Nick in again? Because he says he has it working now. Nick like it's can working. Have like Brad. Several seats because it still says offline. <laughs> Fuck you, Nick. We've, he's been replaced. Tell Nick's him, busy sorry. painting his nails. Just leave him be. <laughs> he's filing his nails. So who's your favorite superstar, Jared? Superstars, that's kind of changed over the time. Like, when I was younger, I loved Triple H. Triple H was, like, my top guy when I was younger. I, I would always watch my brother. I would always watch to see Triple H. As time has okay, gone on, answer. and, like... Uh, <laughs> Define the my word. My answer will be my answer. <laughs> Um, but then, like, as I grew older, like, NXT started to come into the full play and stuff. Like, I really, really love Finn Balor. I love everything that Finn Balor does in the ring. It, I know that his character can be stale at times and he can be a bit iffy on the mic. But when the face paint comes on, and especially now with this new leather jacket business, I feel like he's really going along a path that he will be able to show out and really show why he was signed and why people believe that he can be a top guy. Yes, I love mm, the leather jacket. It. The leather jacket I'm here for. Yeah. I feel like it's given him a new it's given it's added some depth to his character. Now if the speaking can follow on with that, I think he'll be on the way to becoming a top star. I think he's gonna become a heel. Oh yeah, I'll be yeah, here for too. It, definitely. The bullet club is I'm coming, here. so I'm here for all of that. I'm ready to just see them really push him in the direction that he should have been. As a bit, I, I generally, I'm seeing what people see when it comes to baby faces. They can be boring and generic. And it gets to the point where you don't want to root for them anymore and that the heels are very interesting and have depth to their characters. Mm-hmm. So are you excited for Mania? Mm. Oh, yeah. I'll be going to watch it with my cousin, actually, just mm. because, like... I'm tired of watching Mania on my own. <laughs> I want to watch it with someone and like really get into the feel of it. Sam, are you watching it the night it airs? I am. Yay! What about you, Gigi? <laughs> what I'm having a mini party. <laughs> Gigi, I can't wear her. Gigi, are you watching WrestleMania, bitch? 
Um, let's see, I get off of work at 7, so it's probably going to be over by then. But no, you know, they're saying like it's it's hashtag free WrestleMania. And I'm not paying for the network again because I ain't going to watch the rest of the shit. So, yeah. I'll probably <laughs> catch it like when I get off of work. It's Didn't you say it's like six, six hours or something? Seven, Seven hours. Oh, hell no. Okay, wait, no. It's like a two-hour pre-show, four-hour actual show, and then a one-hour okay. post-show. <laughs> okay, I'm not going to watch the Diva anti-Total Divas thing. I'm not going to watch that. I'll watch Brock versus Dean. I'll watch Shane because um, he looks fine now after Josh posted that picture. Because before he was looking like Father Time, like a Chris Keeper. I can't do it. Um, what else is happening on WrestleMania? I'm not going to watch Triple H versus Roman. Oh, they were they were really reaching last night to put that match over on Raw. Why? What happened? I've only seen the highlights of like the Divas and what is it about? I see. Well, the stuff for the ladder match as well. They had Roman and Triple H do that big old brawl that they've done three hundred times to build up a big match. Oh, I'm so over that. All the superstars in the back come out to break it up. I'm so over that. It's like, come on, let's spice it up. Let's do something different. But then at the same time, isn't everyone injured now? But why does everybody got to come out? Why do they have to have the wrestlers come out to break up these fights? Why can't they have security? The wrestlers should be like, fuck it. Let them rip each other apart. I'll come and pick up who's left at the end and take the belt. for. Like, it just, it just doesn't make any damn sense to me. No, no, no. You need to accept this, James, because that's the only way Brad got on TV last time. You oh, got to see him. Bitch, so blow. <laughs> blow long and hard, bitch. They let them get that because the, the, some of them ain't going to get paychecks for WrestleMania. So this is day raw before WrestleMania check. Blow Did you know, like, and not including the uh, the twenty man rumble, there's like forty something names on the card already. There's there's gonna be a twenty man rumble. Was it the Andre Agassi thing? Was yeah, it so the, the Andre Agassi fucking battle. Oh my god, that's fucking hilarious, <laughs> Gigi. Yeah, Andre Agassi tennis battle royal. Um, yeah, there's like forty something names crazy. already on the card. I ain't that's got crazy. time. Ain't nobody got time for that. Where's Jared? Seven hours? Jared? Mm-hmm. Oh, you're here? I thought we lost you guys. Yeah, I'm here. Quiet. No, 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 I'm listening. Listening to all this nonsense. Well, you're on our Kiki show because let me tell you something. This Skype has been doing ultimate shows. Nikki usually steers the shows. And <laughs> I just can't today. I'm like, I don't even know where to begin. We don't have that many topics. No, he was steering the show, but he had a little too much wine. And then we went off the road. Yeah, we're just kind of walking through the woods, this bullshit. We're just hanging out, so we're like, you know what? I think it would be... F I just started randomly calling people, so we called Sam while he was at work. And he picked up the phone, all corporate. Hello? <laughs> 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 he didn't even, he didn't even say him. hi no, to the listeners. It was Samuel. <laughs> it's only a bar job. You make it out as if it, like, it was my day job. No, but you should have heard how you picked up the phone. Like I was like, who the fuck is it? Hello? <laughs> Something very popping. Like, hello? hello? I meant to work for it now. Gigi drag. How much work? I'll call you later. <laughs> yeah, that's how you that's how you sound it, bitch. Yeah, Sounds alright. And uh, then Megan just says with the new phone, who this? Like <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> and Nick's just painting his nails. Yeah. And he can't connect because he's using a freaking tuna can to connect online. So <laughs> What's Josh and Tom's excuses? I don't know. I don't know what I don't know what Tom Tom's never oh, online. Oh. I really believe Josh is making like a real Iron Man or something because he's because he's like away and he's like in the government military. <laughs> you think he's building an Iron Man suit? Yeah, he's making an Iron Man. That's what I think. And then he comes back all like hot, like nice, like hi guys, I missed you. Like you're over there making a fucking super soldier. <laughs> you're over there making Steve Rogers too. <laughs> Steve Rogers, That's Captain America, by the way, That's Captain America. All right. Um. Oh, I was gonna say something. I forget. Oh, hold on. I have an incoming call from a bitch. Hold on. Hello? Hello? Bitch, why are you on this one, but I can't connect you on the other one? Bitch, I don't know. Hold on. We have one of the listeners on with us on the other. Um, which one? Jared, official J. Oh, okay, that's good. I wanted to actually get him on, like, months ago. So that's uh, awesome. Can you believe that this bitch is not American? What bitch? Jared. Really? Hold on. I'm going to go back to the other chat. This is such an interesting show. <laughs> <laughs> what the heck? Okay. So. So I'm online. Like, I don't know why it's not showing. All right. Hold on. Let me let the guys know. I'm going to try okay. to get them in here. Okay. 
So he guys have interviews. So it guys, yeah. hello. But then, yeah. hello, hi, James. But hello, hi. All right. So I have Nicholas. She's developing this heel character, and this heel character is starting to interest me more with Flair on her side. So I'm beginning to like her again. I liked her when she first came into NXT, Charlotte. As, especially like when you mean? Hold on. come up to the main roster. What do you mean you like she her? Was with Sasha. What do you mean you like her? I really her? like that. You don't like her anymore? No, I, I didn't ah, like uh, enough. when she grabbed the title. <laughs> hold on, wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold when, on. She, when she won the NXT title, okay. I didn't like her that period. I, so there's something rubbing me the wrong way. Rubbish. But then now that she's developing this character with Ric Flair, I'm starting to like her again. I love Charlotte. But hey, I have uh, Oh I know. I have Nick on the other line. For some reason he can't get into this phone call. So oh, hold on. I'm gonna try to try to add him in this one again. Cause it says he's online, okay. but when I try to add him into this group, it's telling me no bitch. Can you remove Megan from it? Because maybe that's why it's not happening. Maybe. What the f <laughs> What happened? What? I'm getting annoyed, man. Hold on, let me tell Nick. Just do a fresh call. Hey, Nick. Nick? Yeah? Alright, it's because I have Megan in the call, too, so I think I've reached capacity. So let me just remove her, and then I'll add you in. Okay, well, well like, how many people are in this fucking chat? That's alright. Relax, okay? You're not gonna get beat up, okay? I promise. Okay, alright. I gotcha. Bitches. No. I'm gonna add you in our call, but it won't tell me if you're in. So when you're in, just let us know, all right? Oh, just I don't add Sam because I like Jared's accent better. Okay. Oh, shut up, <gasps> Sam. Fuck okay. you, I don't think Sam heard that, James. Just okay. All right. Bye. <laughs> Nicholas. Oh, hello. Okay. All right. I'm gonna bring in the girls. Okay. Bring in the girls. Bring in the broads. Okay. <clears throat> hello. Hello, are we fixed? Oh, hello there, lovely. Are, are we back together? Jared? Yep. Hey, we all here. Yeah. Hey. Yeah. How's the nails, Nick? Pardon? What did you say, Sam? How are your nails? My nails are fabulous. Do you like them? No. No. Oh, okay. <laughs> Why are you so fucking shady with my nails, Sam? I'm having it with it. Oh, I wanted to just thank you. I know where them fingers been, that's why. What? You shady bitch. It was towards Nick, what you mean? She said, I'll say it. She asked, you're trying to one you're trying to figure out where Nick's fingers be going in. Oh 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 I know. Because in Canada y'all put y'all milk in bags, I don't know what the fuck else y'all doing. Bitch, whatever. Bitch, what? So, I tell you, if you ever fucking cross the country, like, <laughs> Canadians wait, Nick, are going to attack. Nick, what's the letter after Y, Nick? Z. <laughs> what? It's Z. Yeah, it's a Z. Uh, it's Z. No, it's Z. No, you dumbass Americans can pronounce it Z. It's Z. You're stupid because it, Americans. Because it, because it, uh, it flows well. Y'all add the... to another letter. You added D to the letter Z. That doesn't make any fucking sense. Bitch, whatever. Wait a minute. Say that. We're here to talk wrestling last time Hold I checked. On. Nick, um, we well, haven't spoken wrestling for a good hour. <laughs> Nick, this is nobody's wrestling show. <laughs> this is poor Jared's first time on the podcast, it and it's like fucking podcast. ratchet as hell. That's all right. I didn't. <laughs> That's fine. Did you hear his voice yet? No, somebody said you were an American. No, I'm not an American. <gasps> I'm a Brit. <laughs> Doesn't he sound so beautiful? Better Ooh. than Sam? Yeah, you're you sound like more like clean British, like not so, like, Girl. Not so like rough around the edges, like. Do you think I sound rough around the edges? No, Tom does. Really. No, like, no, 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 Tom does cause... not sound rough around the edges at all. Tom like fucking drag queen clicks and stuff. He's like, <laughs> no, <laughs> no one talks like that in real life. <laughs> you know, no. because like because Jared sounds like new and fresh, like he's like new and fresh British. Like you and Sam, you and Tom sound like you've been in Britain for a minute. Yeah, you guys have been around. <laughs> well, I'm not. I have so like smokers. <laughs> um, G- I do smoke. Gigi says uh, he has a Mary Poppins, and he's like Benedict Cumberbatch and Andrew Lincoln. It's like, <laughs> oh, it's this. 
that over there. She's like, Newman Crush. Gigi Ooh, said, <laughs> Jared, we're going to have to use your voice for like projects or something coming up. Oh, I'll be I'll be on it. <laughs> oh. Gigi said that she wants to replace one of the Brits with him. <laughs> <laughs> mm-hmm. <laughs> Maybe, okay. maybe Jared could be on the new Behind the Shade. <laughs> that would be fabulous. Uh, that's what Josh, since we were talking about, we were just talking about Josh earlier, and he's like talking about it. He's like, hey, when are we going to do the next Behind the Shade? This, that, and the third. And I was like, I don't know. Like, I'm down to do a new one soon. I think it would be fun. Uh, uh, well, I think after Mania, we maybe, should yeah. do something else anyway. Well, we've got the fantasy book and stuff coming up. And are we doing another fan song? Fan slams I, I think fan slams should be summer, so. Yeah, I mean, like, we've got that in, like, what, five months' time? It's because they don't have summer in Canada. That's why he got confused, Sam. This <laughs> time, <laughs> oh, my God, Gigi. Oh, fucking the Queen of Shade has arrived. <laughs> and to Nick. Fucking where has she been this whole time? And then coming at me, coming for my edges. Excuse you. Excuse me that I'm busy. I'm so sorry. Can I got things to juggle. Can someone explain to me? What? Like, literally. Can I need someone to go through the whole snatching edges phrase at me. Because <laughs> I'm a white Brit and I have no clue. You don't know what's okay, so is. let me let me educate you because it's a black thing, first of all. <laughs> <laughs> so, black, black people have a thing called, like, baby hairs and edges. And it's, like, at the front of your hair. And it, it's, like, it's what looks nice. Like, at the front of your hair. And then, like, as you do more hairstyles and fuck up your hair, your edges go away. And it's just kind of like hair coming out your scalp and just like going back. Exhibit A, and then like, Alicia Fox. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Alicia has no edges. I think Sasha has edges because like it blends in well with her weave. I'm pretty sure Naomi still has hers even though she does the braids. So like, that has like hers. Alicia has seen Beyonce a lot so her edges haven't snatched. <laughs> Right, okay. So edges being snatched means like when somebody rips your wig off or something. <laughs> like, I don't know, like when like Eva Marie, when she came out, she snatched edges because everybody was shocked. Like, oh really? Eva Marie's out here? I love all like the American slang and like British slang. Like Jared. Gigi. If, mm-hmm. you said, if Jared you said bird, if someone was a bird, Jared, what do you think that is? Like, oh, it's a girl. Like she's a bird, she's fit. So yeah, fun. see? Hey, Gigi. Gigi. Oh, yeah, Gigi. we did go Hold over. on. Gigi, are you a bird? Hmm? Are you a bird, bitch? <laughs> the whole suck man I am. Huh? I hope to some man I am. Like, the, if I'm, it's a British guy, I hope I'm a bird. But, but like, if it's we... like a New York guy, I don't want to be a bird. <laughs> <laughs> like, Gigi, what do you want to be, then? Gigi, no, because if I call Gigi a bird, she will cuss fight. me out. <laughs> <laughs> that sounds like you a bird bitch like a bird for an American is like a woman who goes everywhere she's a hoe birds like, go everywhere people. they fly around like, yeah that's a scat over here yeah a we what? call it like a scat a, a scat scare. or yeah. a tramp Ooh. or a whore you call them a skid or a skat skat k-e-t or like skid like skid marks like a skid like a a skat s-k-e-t so what does that even mean? You're a scat. Yeah. You're a dirty girl. You're not a whore. You're a whore. Yeah, street. you're a whore. You're a slut. Hey. You're Sonny. <laughs> you are, yeah. So Perfect. Sonny is, uh, is a scat. <laughs> Exhibit A. Sonny. Exhibit B. Tom is a scat. <laughs> <laughs> well, Tom's a pretend scat. <laughs> yes, he is. Exhibit C. James is a becoming a scat. Listen. Oh no, he's coming back to being a skit. He was head skit for a minute, but then he went away. (laughs) Once upon a time, not long ago, I was a (laughs) skit. That sounds like the start of your autobiography. Listen, I was never a skit, okay, bitch? Why the fuck you lying? Never. Why are you always lying? Why do I have this reputation that I'm some skit? Because when (laughs) when we were in the other place, you had the rap. Because of that Cause fucking... He's being messenger. Oh, my God. The night I had. Then he's acts like we're going to forget it. Listen. No, on the other show, I think it's because that toothless bitch with the fucked up grill <laughs> said ooh, something ooh. about... <laughs> <laughs> about me being some kind of hoe. And it's not true. The and grapes? I, not the grapes. The other one. The stem. <laughs> the other one. I don't know. Anyways... <laughs> Who cares? <laughs> but, I just, this show is going down. 
<laughs> We're not even on the hill anymore, Nick. James is scatters. The grapes. <laughs> <laughs> the bag uh, of grapes. Damn. That that's, was, uh, it's so sad that we can't tell the listeners that joke because <laughs> it's an inside joke. <laughs> it is the best thing ever. <laughs> Oh, it's funny. <laughs> <laughs> I'll say that. Wondering. And then a picture of Selena Gomez taking out the trash. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, it's so funny. Oh, that's my favorite. We'll have to fill you in, Jared, sometime. <laughs> yeah, like, we can't do it when it's recorded. Yeah, now. we're not going to do it because we, we got time for it. But anyway, <laughs> let's move on. What's the, what Are else? we going to talk some wrestling? <laughs> Uh, oh, sure. Nick said, you want to God. Talk about? Here's Nick wanted to go by the book. I know. Nick always got to stay clear. Listen, what did I tell the listeners? I said, Nick's not here to get us on track and tell us <laughs> where to go because they think I'm going to be able to do it. I can't do it. I'm not doing it. <laughs> okay, that's why you know. Nick's going to be like a teacher or something. Okay, guys, I need everyone. Guys, get back on track. Listen, <laughs> this like, is I, fucking, I fucking roared when um I was at school and you were like, you look like... um. Fucking what's his name's underling? What's his name? Mark Carano's underling in my photo from oh. school. <laughs> you know what's crazy? This is exactly. You know what? TPP needs to have order. Okay. Uh, this is exactly how it is in our group texts. Me, Gigi, Sam, and then we all go in at each other. Then Sam, Nick will pop it. Did you guys get that done yet? Did you? <laughs> <laughs> Did you do this? Again? I give homework to these bitches. We could all be like Aaron and Jay, Laundry, and Nick's like, okay, let's go do a top five then. <laughs> yeah, we got a top five to do this week. We have three top fives this week. And anybody here? Have- <laughs> yeah, but Tom yeah, and Josh three top too, fives, right? and none of them get done. None of them ever get done. <laughs> none of them. No. You know what, bitches? I've been and trying to get fast. I'll be there after I get out of my workout. Oh, I gotta go work out. That was just yesterday, so I don't know. And every no, oh, the best one was when Josh was waiting for you, but then like you left to go help that dude, and then we never heard from you again. I'm saying like he could be fucking somebody right now. <laughs> 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 Josh, that's so bad. I felt, Josh is like, where's James? I felt so bad that night, though. But you know, things happen. Hello, <laughs> we all got lives. Like, he's like, I have to go help him. He has a, his tire. He needs him to his tire fixed. I'm like, he's rotating something else right now. <laughs> oh, <laughs> okay. she ain't lying though. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, CG is lying. It is what it is. Because I, I remember exactly. I remember that day. Go on, fill us all in. Tell everyone. No, it's that, story time. That's when I... It's a and story. That was when <laughs> I... in Rhode Island. <laughs> you know, because I, I am the non-scene um, cast member of Total Divas. So <laughs> they missed out this part of my episode. No, it was when I was chilling with Nate. That's all it was. Oh, not Nate. Oh, him. Oh, uh, I I grinded on the Nate at Chippendales. That motherfucker was so fine. Ooh, which one? It was it was the one I put like he's my he's my. I'll I'll, I'll, I'll resend the picture. That motherfucker is so mm-hmm. fine. Uh-uh. Oh, there was, I know. There were so many of them. <laughs> I'm getting distracted yeah, got, by your um, Wade Barrett abs photo here too. It keeps like I'm, I meant to put his face, like his like yelling face, but it just focused on his abs. So I'm fine mm-hmm. with it. I'm okay with that. Really? You're Alicia that? was okay, but then, you know, you see what happened with that. Oh, uh, well. But she got herself a new man now. <laughs> An old man. Oh, that old man. <laughs> no. Like, it's no totally this. That's disgusting. I'm like, Alicia, if you're going to get a white dude, get a white dude. Like, what is that? <laughs> she has the right one. <laughs> the that, right is, one. that is, that is, that mm, is, mm. Ew. I mean, well, yeah. I mean, it's Sam's taste. So he looks like, he looks like the kind of dude that wears sandals with socks. Like, no. He looks like, <laughs> he, looks like he got money. He looks like he got money because that house was huge that Alicia walked Yeah, in. yeah. So she knows what she's doing. She knows exactly what like, she's he doing. Had that, like, he had that, like, red skin that white guys get because they've been out in the sun for two no. like, well, hours. Nice, I was not looking at his skin. I was looking at them high walls in that house. I was like, these walls are high. <laughs> James was thinking, money. we can get a suspension in here. <laughs> I can put a stripper pole. <laughs> I can hang from that. <laughs> no, like, he looks like he got money. Money. He He's not going to stay with her long, her nonsense. You kidding me? Did you guys, speaking of Alicia Fox and Total Divas, did you guys see that funny tweet I retweeted on our official Twitter? Somebody put, <laughs> they put the picture of Thea Trinidad with her hand up, like, yes. <laughs> they were like, who'd you think was going to be the partner? Mama <laughs> Bella? Like, I got my life. 
That was hilarious. That was the funniest tweet I've seen all night. I'm getting a Thea Trinidad. Thea Trinidad is a kiki. I love her. I don't know her. Yeah, you do, bitch. <laughs> uh, you know what, Jared? If you were in our group chat, this bitch, we've been trying. We've been getting a lot of love from the indie women as of late with TPP. Yeah, because they ain't got no love to give to anybody else to. But uh, us. Hey, listen. <laughs> I was upset that we turned into the Salvation Army for a little bit. The fuck? <gasps> <gasps> She said it. You better recognize. I love them. Gigi's just being a hating ass bitch. This is coming from the same bitch who likes that grease ball, Dean Ambrose. Yeah, really. That's just mm. a fucking mess that doesn't even I'm know so how to wrestle. I'm sorry, I like someone who came up out the Indies and made it. I'm he so can't sorry. even throw a damn. I'm not. Punch. Y'all, if I have to click more than five links to find a wrestling show, I ain't got time. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And Are you still watching Lucha? You, you we can't all have our types, though. She can't even click on to Monday Night Raw. Never mind, click on to anything Excuse else. Excuse me, I get off at work at six thirty. I'd be tired. I'm not trying to watch Triple H. <gasps> In Roman, huh? And when I fight you, huh? I'm not trying to watch that. Well, that's why you got to find an alternative. <laughs> and, and, and it's and not that's, like when y'all be, I'll come in the chat. The divas were so great. I don't hear shit else. So I'm not about to go do that, okay? That's why you need to find an alternative like how we did. And we went off to the indie girls and they be fucking delivering. So don't talk on shit that you don't know, bitch. Yeah, then I gotta find, and then like it'd be like at one camera or one or two camera angles. <laughs> You'll be surprised. In the, the, the audience, I'm sorry. I like the answer. This hateful I, 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 little I'm girl. She, <laughs> she has yet to watch, sit through one match, and she's already dragging. I can't play. I don't give a damn. I don't know what you're talking about, girl. I don't know. Oh, you yeah, don't but, know Candice LeRae? Oh, I'm sorry. I know Candice LeRae. Girl, you're the, you're, this is girl the I know Candice LeRae. She loves these two guys. She likes Dean Ambrose and she likes Dolph Ziggler, who gives you the same fucking match every week. Every week is the same fucking every, match. But every week he's on TV. The, I'm like the people that Every like, week it's the same fucking match. It's the same ugly face from Dean Ambrose with his receding hairline and thinning too. hair. And, and then you the same get, and then you get the Quit same you. bullshit from Dolph Ziggler, who's just a middleman. He'll never move up. He'll never take that extra you step. Middleman up in the so, Jared, this is what happens every week. Jared's just, like, sitting in the corner right now, like, oh, God. <laughs> he got a like, popcorn now. He's like, ready. You don't get the same. You're like, guys, just stop it. No, he's just <laughs> listening to Gigi reaching. Gigi has been mm-hmm. reaching. I want to hear mm-hmm. that nice accent more. Mm-hmm. Look at Nick. Nick, Yo, Nick. Nick, you have a man. For real. <laughs> <laughs> Simmer down now, bitch. Hey, hey, we, more bo- hey we both like an accent. No, there's not a lot of people in Canada. It's fine. But you know what, Jared? Hey. Since Nick wants to hear you talk, I actually do have a question for you, bitch. What were you saying about my girl when I rudely interrupted you earlier? <laughs> um. Okay, basically. Okay, okay, let me let me clear the air. Um... So I got asked, what do I think of Charlotte? And, okay, at the beginning, I really liked her. I I really liked her athleticism. I really liked what she was bringing to the NXT division. When she got that title, however, in NXT, I felt like she became very loudmouthed. A lot of her interviews, I, I felt there was a bit of arrogance there without her really actually being on the main roster when she was saying, oh, yeah, that she'll change things. But then she came up... After the messy face turn and with PCB and all that bullshit, and she turned heel, and that she was with Rick, she's actually started to prove herself more and more. I do want that uh, her mic skills to improve because I'm sick and tired of her shouting constantly. I mean, I don't want to have to be turning my TV down just to be hearing her shouting. <laughs> but I'm gonna let you know. Ov- overall, I'm gonna let you I like her a lot more now than I did last year let's say let's put it like that okay so you didn't like her in nxt is that what you're saying um i didn't like her when she won the nxt title that wow. period from then until about her heel turn i haven't really liked her i liked her I when agree. she first came and when she was with sasha and summer had moved up those two periods were when i really liked charlotte and i was ready to take i was ready for her to take the title off page page i can't stand let me not get into her, but anyway. <laughs> Dang, I can't find like bitch. Me. She's British. We gotta look after our own. I don't give a damn. I don't like her. Why? Now, like, he got saved by Jesus. Why don't you... Hold on, hold on. No, we, we're not gonna go to Paige yet. I, I'm gonna... I have to defend my girl with that shouting comment that you just... 
<laughs> she does though. I that's don't think the, she's that's the one thing I do not like about her on the mic is because she's actually getting better. Like now I can feel the personality coming from her. But when she shouts, it's just like, okay, calm down, simmer down a bit. Her dad but, shouts. Her dad is also annoying when he shouts. That's, her dad woos. That's where she I gets don't. it from. And she talks like her dad. Very pompous, arrogant, cocky, in your face. They yell at you. That's how she she's above it all. That's why she yells at everybody. When you're a girl like that and you're yelling, it gets a little bit scary. I love, <laughs> shut up. I love But overall she's improved. And that's she, what I'll say. She's listen, definitely improving that she's she, finding her place. Listen, she's improved the division. She hasn't improved her damn self. She's she's been that health packet that this division's needed for a long time. Her and Sasha and um Sasha Becky. and Becky, just all the NXT girls. They're that that health package that this dying division needed. And um Sasha Banks um Sasha Banks is there, but Charlotte is at the top of the tear. This girl Not for long. This girl is the WWE Divas champion. She's going into WrestleMania. This is our first WrestleMania Divas defense of the title in a serious match. Not an AJ Lee versus the world type bullshit to get uh, every woman in the okay. card. Like I hate stuff like that. And I always said it when Charlotte was in NXT and NXT I said once she makes it up to the main roster it's going to be a different playing ground because this girl is no fucking joke. So I've loved Charlotte from day one so I, I don't get why you didn't like her. I really don't. As I said, it's not it's cool necessary. though. It wasn't anything like she was bad. Like I didn't really see her as someone who was bad in the ring or someone who couldn't perform. It was just it was in it was more of her attitude that I didn't like. Mm -hmm. Just from what I read in interviews and some of the things that she said. But now that she's coming to the main roster and she's actually proving herself, I can actually see where she was coming from at that time. Attitude. Yeah, just some oh, of the comments, no. like, just some of the comments, like, oh, yeah, I'm going to change the... I know, like, you, you she's are. being Listen, confident. She I has she's being to talk confident. like that. Oh, you open a can of worms? She yeah, has to talk right. like that. You're damn right. If I was signed to be WWE, a WWE superstar, you're damn right every interview. I'm going to be the best. I'm going to be better. She's not going to say she's going to be second best. She's a fucking flair. So if that's true, damn right she better damn say But at the same time, you can't really say that when you haven't been on the main roster she's to experience what the other girls have she, done. She's a flair. You do have other girls on. Are you still defending Charlotte? <laughs> I don't know what happened. Oh, Come on, you guys God. lost each other. Yeah, we did. Hold on, let me add everybody in. <laughs> the listeners are gonna fucking get a kiki with this drive. <laughs> <laughs> it is all over the place. Here we have guests, ladies. <laughs> Look at where the hell is Nick? Is it just us, Gigi? Okay, now that it's just me because I left the library, but over here dragging Miss Charlotte. I ain't gonna let it happen. <laughs> no way. Well, that's a big girl to drag, so oh, if you're doing it correctly. Bitch. How do I mute this bitch? <laughs> <laughs> what? It is what it is. Jared, yeah. you wasn't feeling um, Charlotte. That's all right. That's fine. That's your prerogative. You can do whatever you want. What? <laughs> what, bitch? Bitch, what? <laughs> like, to be honest, like, the only... Are we still talking about big bitch Charlotte? <laughs> oh, no, no, no more. <laughs> I was just telling him he got it. He, he good. You good. Let's get Jared. Uh, Go on. I think the only diva that I do, I the only divas I don't like are Paige and this girl is nothing personal. I just don't find her interesting. But Emma, those two are probably the only two which <coughs> I just I do not connect with in okay. any in any way. Those two, but besides them, I think everyone else I'm cool right. with on the way. That's fair. Yeah. All right. So Jared, where can people follow you at? It's been fun. It's been real. Thank you for coming on. No problem. It's, it's been an honor. I, I've, I've actually, I've always wanted to come onto one of these things, but just the time and when it's right, and I felt like tonight it, it was the right time. It was fun. Yeah, <laughs> yeah and, uh, it was nice to be a part of the shade, hear the shade. Yeah, you really came Get in a on a shady it. day. <laughs> oh yeah, Gigi definitely brought it on today. <laughs> oh, thank you, thank you, thank you. <laughs> 
<laughs> but Jared, where can the listeners follow you if they want to? Thank you for being a guest star on my show. <laughs> um, and uh, everyone could follow me at Official J. Uh, wait, is that Official J? <laughs> It is. I forgot my drama. <laughs> Isn't it like official um, J one one seven? Yeah, official J one one four. No one one four. Oh, you want us to put numbers at the end? Okay. Yeah. Mm. No, I had to because someone was like take it, uh, was taking my pictures for my account and like creating an account of them, so I had to like switch it up and completely make myself. You were getting catfished now. Yeah, someone was catfishing me, so I had to literally change everything about my account at one point i even put it on private because oh. like it was getting out of control and like now i've got it all together so you didn't say literally that it in the brits <laughs> <laughs> i don't even mean to sound so proper like when i'm with friends and stuff i'm not i'm not I that, that you sound proper you just you just sound better than them it's e- you're easier oh. to understand ah let me take the compliment then let me take it let me take it I think it's because he's from London. He has that TV British accent that we hear on television. <laughs> to me, at least. He sounds like, sounds like Henry Cavill. So beautiful. <laughs> well, thank you, Jay. You're going to come back again. Next time we'll have you on a legit show so we can actually talk some wrestling. Oh, okay. I'll be glad to. Thank you. This was a legit show. <laughs> have a good Thanks. one. <laughs> you Bye. too. Night. Bye. So, Gigi, bitch. It has been so real having you back on the show with us this week. How do you feel? I, I just like that the show I came back on was complete mayhem. <laughs> it's like when Brock came back and punched Cena in the face. It's so beautiful. <laughs> I know. Go figure. This show Gigi comes back to is all over the fucking place. But that's all right. Sometimes we got to give him our ratchet ways and be like, take it and deal with it. Maybe it's going to show how WrestleMania is really going to be. Hot, lit, and popping. <laughs> Are you really not going to watch WrestleMania, bitch? I'm going to watch select parts. Okay, I, I don't have a lot of time in my life now, James. Oh, she's just a I'm for girl. sure going to watch Dean. Wait, isn't um, Dolph in the ladder match? Who? <laughs> That's the same thing they said when they fired Brad, and then Vince was like, who? <laughs> I don't even know. Did we hire him? But yeah, I think he's in the ladder match, and that's going to be a good 30 minutes, and then Dean's going to be a good, like, 45, probably. Mm-hmm. And then I'm damn done. sure not going to watch that tag team thing, because that just seems like a shit show. Like, even when you guys are describing it, it just sounds like a shit show. No, it's actually, they have a good build-up going on, so you should check it out. Any Anytime it's a Bella, it's a little bit of shit. Check it out. It's pretty good. But Gigi... I'm, I'm, I'll live... Where can the listeners follow you at? Well, if you forgot, it's at True G on Twitter, Gorge.George on Instagram. Don't send me dick pics because that's been happening lately, and it's disgusting. She loves it, so continue on. <laughs> and you guys can unless, unless Unless you're like Bruce Wayne, don't send me a dick pic. <laughs> if she wants it. And you guys can follow me at Jimmy James, J-A-Y-M-E-S. Thank he also though he has a grinder, guys. So if you're in Rhode Island for some strange reason, because no one wants to be there, I have the grinder for the time being. That grinder is going to be probably deleted by the end of the week. <laughs> <laughs> okay, don't, okay, bitch. Listen, bitch. Don't try me before I throw your ass into the river with your boy Deeb. Splash. Mm-hmm. Oh, and then Zara's soul, her little Nazi soul. Stop. Oh, did you take the blue, the My Little Pony out of there too? The Nazi one. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs>